So, so okay, so uh, I went to a school called uh, uh, GIT a long, long time ago. It, MI, it's called MI now. It's a musical school it's out in Hollywood. And uh, I went there when it was first beginning effective. And my class was uh, Scott Henderson, jazz guy, whatever, Scott Henderson. He was actually a classmate. He wasn't a, he wasn't a teacher. He was, my, he was the guy next to me. So he practiced more, I think. And um, also we had uh, Jennifer Batten, uh, Frank Gambali was after me, uh, Paul Gilbert, those guys. So when I came back from the school, I went back to St. Louis where I live. And uh, one of the, co the companies I worked for was called St. Louis Music that did great in Ampeg, all that. The guy who was the financial guy of the company, really great guy, came up and said, my son has been playing violin and drums. He wants to play guitar. He's 13 years old. Would you take him as a student? And I was only teaching professionals. So I came back from the school. I had all this information on how to, how to look at the guitar, how things work. You know, I, I was really kind of ready to teach professionals, not beginning students. And I said, no, I, I, I don't really take <clears throat> beginners. And he, and he said, man, my, my son's really passionate about this. He wants to quit playing drums and violin, and he wants to play guitar. Because I guess because chicks dig guitar players. Yes. I don't know. <laughs> and not, not violin players. I don't know. So I hear. So anyway, so he came along, and, and I taught him. He was my, I was his first teacher. That's the guitar player for Guns N' Roses, uh, Rich Fortas, the guy with the tattoos. All those, those moves, but I taught him all that kind of stuff. <laughs> Actually, I didn't. But yeah, he, and I, I, I saw him, uh, uh, let's see, uh, we were doing the tour, the, uh, the reunion tour they had with uh, Axel and all that. And I was on a flight to Los Angeles. He was on my, on my flight. And uh, he was a great guy. He, he, he's, you know, he lives in St. Louis still. He lived in New York for a while, in LA. He played with, uh, what's the band? Uh, Thin Lizzy. Wow. He was with them for a while, and I was with Guns N' Roses. Uh, great guy, really great player, really, you know, it's, I'm proud of, I'm proud of work, what he's done uh, as, a, as a musician and, and as, a, as a human being. Um, and actually, during our conversation, uh, he was asking me, because I'm on the road, I'm, I'm, we're, like, we're out like three months at a time. I, I go out for a couple weeks, and I go back home, I see my, my grass, and I cut my grass, it's great. He's gone for like three months or so in these tours. He says, you know, I need, need something for my hotel room. What do you suggest? I mean, what do you guys have at Black Star? I mean, we're sitting on the plane talking about this. And I said, well, you got this weird little amplifier. It's a little battery amplifier that a lot of guys use backstage. You might want to check it out. So I, I sent him one to check out, and that's what he's been, he's been playing on the road, is that amp. It's, just, it's a little amp here called the, called the Fly. It's this little big, big thing. It runs on batteries. It runs on DC. And a lot of guys use that backstage. It's a, it's a great little amp, and that's what he's been using. So yeah, so Rich, Rich Forrest is my student. He was, a, he was a 13 year old kid, little skinny kid, black hair, couldn't sit still, you know. <laughs> Those guys, you know, slow down, slow down, you'll never be a star that way. I was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, great, great, really great guy. Great, super good. So, yeah, and that's the amp that he's using backstage. When he's talking about. Here's the amp my, my student uses. This is the, the guy from Guns N' Roses backstage. Hey, Rich, how you doing, buddy? Um, it runs uh, three, three watts, three-inch speaker. It has two, two channels, kind of a clean and overdrive, tape delay, and control that. You've got a headphone output, MP3 input, and there's two versions. One version, well, actually three versions. There's a bass version for bass players out there. There's also a Bluetooth version, and then also there's a normal plug-and-play kind right here. And uh, it sounds kind of like this. Is, you can also add a second cabinet to play stereo. And it's a pretty remarkable sounding amplifier. Uh, I did a show in, uh, in, in Shanghai in October. And I was playing with the guitars from, from Deep Purple. And uh, I he used a stack, I used that. So let me. So here's the amp without anything on it. It's a straight amplifier. <laughs> so I'm going to use just the, the one speaker by itself. <laughs> it's a little it's tape delay. A little more gain if I push it a little harder. It 
has ISF, so it goes from coffee to tea, like everything else in Black Star. <laughs> more gain if I hit it harder. Okay, so it sounds pretty good. So if you add the other cabinet to this, here's the other second cabinet, listen how it changes. I can do this with one hand. That's doing so well. Comes alive. So if you, you buy the, the, the two versions together, these two together, it comes with a little power supply. It runs on batteries. It runs for about 50 hours on a battery, or about uh, with, the, with the DC supply, it runs for forever, of course. There's also a Bluetooth version. It does the same thing with Bluetooth. So, uh, if I can mic it up, I can turn on the PA for a second, wherever Francis or you about or Hong. Hong is in charge. Ladies and gentlemen, Hong, he's the world's best sound man. In fact, he's my only sound man. No, no singing along either, like last night. That will delay. tonight you bring an amplifier as a matter of fact I did <laughs> just set it up right here put a mic on it like that I swear, I almost finished. We got these poor guys that came from Barneo to play, so I got to make sure that uh, I give you time to play. He's a remarkable player, remarkable musician. So, Jay Hayes, Black Star UK, visiting KL. I want to thank everybody at CK Music for having me. I had a great time, a uh, really wonderful crowd tonight, one of the probably best clinic ever, and uh, had, a, had a great time. Again, check out CK Music and Black Star. Terima kasih and jumpa lagi.